I'm Jess. I'm a nurse and a mom with a passion for flipping furniture. I'm using that passion to pay my way to gain my master's in nursing. So join me in this journey and let's flip this script. That's the midnight blue, it's absolutely gorgeous. And then I wanted to show you how I do my drawers when I'm using a spray gun. Um, and that is to use cardboard or anything. You could use a board just to do the edges and then you don't have to tape everything off and paint doesn't get everywhere. Um, because when you do use a spray gun, there is quite a bit of overspray. Um, so I always lay down tarps and plastic and yeah, just cover your area because Especially if the wind picks up, it will get everywhere. Oh, I see I missed a spot right there. <laughs> so these, these are just so old school. Um, definitely don't want to use those on my, you know, updated dresser. However, I was looking at this part and I'm like, that's kind of cute. I like that part. So I ended up being able to, um, with the pliers and a hammer, to get this part out. So I think once I clean this up to gold again, I think it's going to be really cute with just this throwing away the rose part i like it all right so i stained the interior like the borders and when i put it all together i, I hate it i hate how it looks it's streaky it just doesn't look cohesive so i stop. i went to one of my local stores and i picked up another um batch of midnight blue fusion paint so we're gonna paint it all blue and see how it looks okay so now this is one of my favorite parts now that the piece is completed you can see that I did end up going um, painting this the blue the midnight blue instead of the wood it just looks more classic it looks more modern um, the other one it just looked too it just didn't it wasn't cohesive um, and I love it so much more and now my favorite part is staging so I kind of forgot to record this part but I always include greenery a plant um, especially with this blue it just pops um, I like to include candles and then I thought the salt lamp just really added um, a beautiful element I like to incorporate books I'm a big book nerd and I just I love how it looks in there and then I take it to a well-lit room where you have good natural light um, I try to incorporate like a rug, make sure there's no clutter, um, and just try to stage it in a way that you think potential buyers could picture it in their own home and do that. When I take the photos, I like to include um, the pictures staged, unstaged, so they don't think you're hiding anything. Uh, just one second, and I take from multiple angles, I include the dimensions, and any damage, I take close-up photos because you want to save um, your buyers and your own time. You don't want people coming to look and then deciding not to buy. So that's how. It so that's gonna be it for our first ever furniture flipping video here on YouTube. Um, I hope you guys will like, comment as long as it's nice, um, subscribe, and join the journey as I try to pay my way through nursing practitioner school. Um, I've got a garage full of projects waiting for me, so I hope you guys will stick around for the ride.